breakfast. Well, hey, it's Swoonworthy Wednesday with our friend Julia Spaulding from Indianapolis Monthly Magazine. And she's, jo excuse me, just <laughs> choked on something. Do you need there. some water? I'm good. She's joined by Chicken Master, Derek Hurt from Duke's Honky Tonk in Indy. That's a That's title. That's right. I want to know how he was up, deemed. How are you? Chicken Happy master. How are you? Hi, Julia. Welcome, Hi. friend. Hi, guys. You. How are you? So great to have you here. Thank you for having us. So let's talk about why this is Indianapolis Monthly's wow. Swoonworthy Dish. Mm. Well, first of all, Duke's is one of Indy's iconic establishments. Yes. And yeah. it has been since day one, since the day it opened 2018. Um, it is one of a kind, primarily a music venue. Um, you get some beer and uh, learn how to do the line dancing, but it's always yeah. had this great lean and mean menu. Mm. And the fried chicken has always been the staple. Yeah. Um, and it's uh, based on a recipe that was perfected by the uh, founder, okay. Dustin. Nice. Um, who was a visionary in so many ways, so many really cool ways, and so, um, we just kind of fell in love with the uh, Dustin's Fried Chicken Dinners yeah. at Duke's. And um, yeah. Derek has, has kind of like played around with the recipe, uh, perfected it even more, and added to the menu. Yeah, it took a little bit of work. Um, I came on to Duke's about two years ago, and the legend of Dustin loomed large, and especially mm. the chicken. <laughs> yeah. The chicken, I always heard about the chicken. and. Uh, we, the, one of the main things when we came back in February, we shut down for about a month for yeah. some restructuring, yep. new management, and one of the things was we gotta have the chicken. Okay. We have to. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the chicken. They got the chicken. <laughs> yeah. They have uh, the chicken. I, I feel like we need to have the chicken. We have to have the chicken. <laughs> yeah, what's the secret to this chicken or that you can share? So it does a 72 hour brine. Um, again, that was Justin's recipe, yep. and we do a dredge on it right before it fries. Um, the recipe I had of Dustin's yes. wasn't exactly complete, mm. we think. <laughs> we tooled around with it and eventually started adding mm. dry rub, which was again his recipe, mm -hmm. to the mixture. And okay. that's when people started saying, mm. that's the chicken. Yeah. So, okay. like any good cook, yes. he didn't exactly have a complete <laughs> right. recipe. It was all up here. So. Mm. Mm. And the great thing about this the is crunch. it is a dinner. It has all the fixins. Oh um, the mm. Brussels sprouts, the roasted Brussels sprouts with the uh, pickled red onions, pepitas, apples. It's roasted Brussels sprouts, Brussels sprouts are just amazing to mm -hmm. begin with. And the recipe here is amazing. The uh, macaroni and cheese, the um, cavatappi so, corkscrew, wow. uh, or spiral uh, noodles mm -hmm. for maximum yeah, cheese, cheese gathering yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. surface. Yeah. I, I housed my chicken wing. You got yours yeah. done already? It's gone. I, I can see why, because I can't stop eating it right yeah. now. So this the, is so the mac great. and cheese is, uh, is a good side. Tell me about these pickles here. Those are all homemade. The, oh, wow. Every mm. sauce we do is homemade. The pickles are homemade. Mm. I mean, pretty much everything's <laughs> scratch. Uh, yeah. The, uh, our other cook had brought over that recipe for the pickle. Yeah. Um, that's along with a few other recipes that are fantastic. Okay. They pair really well together. Um, admittedly, the cheese sauce isn't the same as Dustin's. It's oh. a little different. A little different, okay. So, you know, the chicken's true, but, you know, some things change. Mm. Um, I've gotten good reviews on it, so. I can see why it's delicious. <laughs> I know. Very, very good. This is just the perfect kind of comfort meal right here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's remind everybody how they can find you and check mm. you out. Wow. Dukesindy.com is the best way to find us. Um, it, you can see a whole list of shows. You can see all the our dinner and lunch menu. We're open Tuesday through Saturday. Lunch and dinner, Saturday brunch coming the 27th. Ooh, right. Oh, awesome. Okay. And Julia, where can people find the new issue of Indianapolis Monthly? Uh, the April issue is on newsstands now. You can also go to IndianapolisMonthly.com to check out uh, information about great fried chicken and lots of other yeah. great food stories. Isn't that so, cover great too? Yes, and page oh, and that. 37 <laughs> ain't bad either. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, that, that cover really is great That cover is so cool. I love it, yeah. Thank and you so much. Stuff. All the information to pick up the latest issue on your screen. I'm gonna finish my chicken leg as well. <laughs> we get a Brussels sprout. Absolutely. Thank you. Uh, who's Absolutely. Got the Amazing, that's you okay, to start. Right. Well, coming up next, we're gonna get a preview of the Indianapolis Chamber Orchestra's upcoming show called Black Keys. It features dance, singing, and compositions by black classical musicians. That's right, we'll be right back after this. Mm.